Hello guys, welcome to the C1 Engineering YouTube channel. Please subscribe our channel for more C1 Engineering updates. Today our topic is about the components and the elements of the road. Right? I will discuss the different uh, elements of the roads that uh, which a road is composed of. So let's uh, start the components of the road. The first component or the element of the road is the carriageway. Carriageway right so this is the diagram the general uh, plan of the road uh, we, I can write it here the general plan of the road and all, all the components of the road are explained here the first one is the carriageway right carriageway is the way in which the traffic moves uh, freely in one direction or maybe in both direction for example this is a carriageway but this is a tool in carriageway because one lane is here and one lane is here. This is a two uh, double lane carriageway. This is the single lane carriageway. The traffic is just moving in one lane. There is no, no other lane. So we call it the single lane carriageway. This is a double lane carriageway, a single lane carriageway. So these are the two carriageways. Right? And the length generally of these two carriageways is the, the single is 3.8 meter we take and the double carriageway at 7 meter generally according to the standards right so the first one is the carriageway in which the traffic can move easily without the disturbance of anything the number second one is the shoulder sometimes it's also called hard shoulder right so the shoulder is the path, is an emergency path of which the vehicle can stop at any time uh, at the sides of the carriageway. So these are the shoulders provided. Right? These are the shoulders. On the right side, and these are the show. This is the shoulder. On the left side, right? It's one shoulder, and this is another shoulder. Right? On the right side. And it's provided just for the emergency cases. Uh, if some vehicle is going to stop, so they can stop and they can move here and this traffic can move here and can stop there for emergency purposes right so number third one is the margin margin now uh, is, the, is, the, is the type of the component of the road which is provided after the after the shoulder right a small portion of the uh, road is provided here we call it the margin it is the last part of the or its last part of the road we call it the margin and uh, this is usually provide for the drains of the water the water usually sometimes moves here drain like water passes into this portion it is the last part of the road let we call it the margin Number four is the well, number four. There is a combination of these two. We can call it roadway. Roadway. Roadway is the uh, is the way is the road consists of the uh, from the shoulder. This is the shoulder, the shoulder, right? From the shoulder to the another shoulder, right? It consists of shoulder and carriageway. The shoulder and carriageway, these both two, we call is the roadway. So roadway is the combination of, what is the combination of carriageway, carriageway plus the shoulder, we call it the roadway, right? So it composes both the, uh, the carriageway as well as the shoulder, so we call this uh, road path, we call the, this distance, uh, we call the roadway of the road. Number fifth one is the right of way. Right of way. Right of way is the, uh, is the whole length of the road from the margin, from the margin to the another margin. The whole length of the road from this margin to this margin. We call the right of way. It's the longest length 
uh, in the hood uh, across this direction we call is right of it's a combination of carry tree plus shoulder plus margin it's a combination of all the uh, parts of all the in the road components we call is the right of way so number six is the median median the median is provided between the uh, opposing road traffic way for example this uh, lane car moves in this direction while these cars move in the opposite direction so they are separated by a type of way a type of uh, separation so we call this separation path is the median right this separation path is called the median uh, provided in every motorway or the highway number seven is the curbs the curbs are provided along the uh, median along the medians you can also see in the pictures I provided each picture of these terms these components of the road they are provided throughout the medians right and both the directions curbs And the number last one, I can say it last one, is the, uh, not last one, guardrail. But the second last one, guardrail. These are also very important, provided mainly in the heavy, hilly areas. They are provided to support the uh, car or the vehicles from accident, from accidents and uh, so some, or, uh, some parts are provided here. You will see images that some uh, some rails are provided at the last portion of the road we call is the guard rail they are provided to support the vehicle to guard the uh, road vehicle right the last one is the building line building line building line is the distance from the center of the road there is the center of the road Sorry, the center of the carriageway. This is the center of the carriageway. And this is the another center of the carriageway. Right? So, the distance from the center of the carriageway to the, uh, to the building site. For example, there are buildings constructed here. There are buildings, right? The homes or maybe another buildings. Or maybe some petrol pumps or some other places. So, the distance from the center of the carriageway to the buildings we denote and we call this is a building line and it a different uh, according to the different standards uh, Japan may provide it some uh, you know, its distance should be more than seven meter and in USA this distance usually provided is five meter so it depends on the country to country how much is the distance from the carriageway to the building line uh, the building should be provided building should not be adjacently made to the road to the margin of the road so there should be some distance so we keep this distance to so that the buildings are not disturbed by the vehicles right this was all about the components and elements of the road and please subscribe our channel for more civil engineering updates